the most thorough Cat, Batman, or Panther Since the movie coming Figure we brush up Let's start from the top Wakanda, a futuristic African nation that has never been conquered by colonialism, is a technological mecca built on magic and metal where disease and poverty are non-existent. In the distant past, a meteorite made of the mineral vibranium crashed in Wakanda. No one in the world would exploit Wakanda for this valuable resource. Black Twitter side note. U.S. government somehow made Captain America's shield of vibranium. Hmm. King T'Challa, like his father and other Panthers before him, concealed his country from the outside world with obvious good reason. Jack Kirby and Stan Lee introduced the Black Panther in Fantastic Four 52, July 66, predating Black Panther Party. He was the first black superhero in mainstream comics. Almost no black heroes were created before him, and none were actual superpowers, not even in all Negro comics. 1972, Fantastic Four 119, he fucked with the name Black Rapper to disassociate with the Black Panther Party. He decided that wasn't the way. He received his first starring feature with Jungle Action number 5, July 1973. Panther's Rage was the first comic created as a complete novel and is a 200 page history of Wakanda. The second and final arch, Panther vs. the Clan, the subject matter scared the shit out the Marvel officers. In 05, Reginald Hyland, director of Boomerang and House Party, added street cred to the title. As influences for his version of the Panther, he said, Batman, Spike Lee, and Puff. Nice, fab voice. He bagged Storm, his longtime sweetheart, and put a ring on it, was almost body by Doom, lost his crown, and his personal guards, and the love of his people, and now sits at the head of the Illuminati with Reed Richards. Yo, this movie is gonna be so fucking hard. And now you know. And no one's 120 degrees of the cipher. Add on.